Hello and welcome, Paul here and I am playing Floris in Mud for Mountain Blade Warband and things are going fairly well for how long I do not know. We've been going after the Rodox and then we've just declared war against, was it the Nords? Are we fighting the Nords now? Yes we are, okay. So the question is, who do I go for at the moment? Alright, Albert Castle, Albert Castle, that's one of mine isn't it? That is indeed one of mine. Let me see if I can find it. It's around here somewhere. There it is. Okay, so now I've got to fight the Nords. And, okay, they're going after Jailbedgy Castle. God damn it. Alright, the Nords are after... The Nords are after our stuff. Alright. So we've got Hyrus Castle here. Let's see how many defenders, 200, besiege the castle, that requires a siege tower, I don't want to mess with that. I'm going to make my way over to Tyr and see if we can do some damage. If the Nords want to start going and start reclaiming the castles we've taken from them, so be it, but we're going to go for their cities. We're going to go for their cities. Do it. Because Nords were always the original target, even though we've done good damage to the Rodox. They've been hurt enough, I'm hoping they'll make peace with us soon. But for the Nords, you know, we've got to... We've got to... Get our boots on their throats, basically, at this point, on their neck. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, this place is kind of sketchy. Gonna take a lot of casualties just as we move in here. Not much I can do, unfortunately. We're taking nasty hits. I need my archers to get in position, though. We haven't lost too many people; they've just been wounded. But if my archers can get in position, start getting those arrows back. Come on, boys! There we go. There we go. Clearing the battlements. Clearing the battlements. They have a lot of people, so I don't want to get into a toe-to-toe -to -toe fight with them just yet. That's it. There we go. There we go. We made it through the front door. Bring your reinforcements. That's fine. Come on. We'll see if they'll actually come down the ramp, maybe fight us. No, they're not. What I want to do is take care of their first set of reinforcements, which are going to be their elites, before I send my troops up. Because let my arrows take care of them, and, you know, the rest. Bugger, they got me. Alright, well. Point still stands. Their elites are going to be here. They're going to come to the front. My archers are going to kill them. And then on the next wave, I'll send my infantry up. As in, I'm going to have to play out this fight and reset it, but at least their strong units like these guys are going to be taken care of. Their rank 6s, their rank 5s, the odd few rank 7s. They're all going to be dead. So I don't have to risk too many of my cavalry or infantry in heavy direct fighting against the enemy. In fact, if they're going to push down now, which it looks like they may, they're going to run into my ground forces anyway, so this works out quite well. There we go. We look at their next set of reinforcements. No elites there. That's it. They're going to push down as well. Perfect. May not even have to reset this fight. Although if they don't all rush down and they stay down there because they got archers, then this may be tricky. Can't feel like we gotta kill this guy. There we go. Get him over there. Still throwing stuff, I'm amazed he's got anything to throw. <laughs> there we go. 
and stuff. So it looks like all of their troops are stuck down there. I'm going to have to end this. Okay. That's unfortunate. Now let's see. Is this guy going to get his head bolted? Oh my god. Rip. Rip. <laughs> that was enough to cause the next set of reinforcements. I like it. Let's let these guys get killed first. Good stuff that is. Good stuff. What rank are these guys? Rank 6 is still. Okay, so they've still got some strong troops. A few of them are now going back up the stairs. I don't know why they kind of bug out like this. Alright, we're going to back out though. Prepare the ladders. Clear the way again first, just to stop any unnecessary casualties, provided I don't get taken out. Come on, archers, you guys. Get in there. Stay low, squadron, stay low. You idiot. Come on, just clear the way, clear the way a little bit. Clear the way, clear the way, clear the way, clear the way. Come on. Come on. That's it. Let's break their shields, get rid of this slot. Go. Let's take the city. That's it boys. Kill him. Perfect. We'll go for Gel Beggy Castle after this and ensure that we hold it still since the nodes are there trying to take it back. Very good. That was smooth. I like it. So, Tear is now ours. That just leaves them with these. Now, Curing Castle's always been a bit of a pain. We could try and go for it though. The Gel Badger Castle was next. I mean, I could just 
just hold off from the Rodox for now. I mean, even though their territory is waning as well, and maybe focus back on the Nords a little bit, I'm hoping they'll make peace soon, but I'm going to lose territory as they start reclaiming a little bit. Can't be helped. Someone's already at tier. Jesus. You run from Angrel, but you run towards me. Oh, and you took it? No, 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 no. Nine hours just trying to retake this. Oh, wait, why, why are we even doing that? I could have just asked them. There we go. <laughs> there we go, that was easy. Done and done. Let's head back to tier and see if we can hold that. We'll see if they go for Jailbedgy Castle. I don't want to be stuck between these two. Yeah, bugger off. How can they take tier when there was no one here? There we go, I've got it back. Alright, we've got to take care of these lads. They're going to be a fawn on our side until we do. Come on. You're mine, sunshine. Even though I'm trying to stay on friendly terms with him. Losing one relation point is not bad. What have we got? Our troops are kind of here and there. Not too great. The enemy is charging. Terrible goddamn terrain to be doing this fight in. Alright, if they're going to charge us, that's fine. Let's put some distance between us and the enemy. Here. You know what, screw it, go for him. Bring death to our enemies. Here they are. I think that's the, the Lord. I don't want to kill him though. Come on, take him out. Don't want to lose any unnecessary relation points. I can help it. There we go. If we take care of this guy, Tear should be saved, and we should probably take care of the guy, Jilbeji. but if I stick in here we might be able to do some good. Run matey. Damn it. 
marchers, bring them down. Get um the dangerous fight this is. in the Baron there that he will take him out. Let's turn back on the enemy see so we can uh, keep him dead. trapped. Come on then. fight that was. And look at all this nice terrain that we could have been fighting on compared to the rest of the sodding map. Oh well. Took a few hits there, not too many. We took him down. I'm gonna let him go. Or if he doesn't escape. So that's tier now safe. I could try and siege Hyrus, but there's not much point. Now the Nords have more territory than the... well... Damn, they took Jug Keller back. God damn it. Not much I can do about that, I'm afraid. Not much I can do. Yeah, the enemy is just taking territory now. I won't be able to keep up with two of them. This is why well, it's annoying when I'm not leader of this faction. Wait. I'm gonna take him out. I'm gonna take him out. Because... I need, I need to. I can't have these guys running around trying to do my handiwork, so... Alright, brothers. Over here. Cavalry, you can follow me. Get the archers in position, get infantry up front to give them a bit of cover. We'll kill as many as we can before we go in on the attack. Sounds like a plan. Archers, move up. Move up, archers, come on. Alright, here we go. You know what? 
Cavalry, into the shield wall. Let's go. There we go. Break their lines. Alright. Free reign to attack. Except for you archers. Let's go. Run them down. There are elites in here, so I've got to be careful. I think we're owning them. Down I go. Getting a bit too brave there. Enjoying a bit of the horse combat too much. It's fine though, we're going to win this. Although, what I wish I could have done was move my archers up to this hill. Give them better view, because right now they're behind a hill and kind of useless. But I believe in my cavalry will be able to do a good amount of damage to the enemy. So I'll trust in them and have a bit of faith. Another Baron dies. Always bad. Always bad. Enemies all over the place here. Stupid lance, I'm gonna be able to do much. Fill on my numbers are waning a little bit. Mostly because my archers are hanging back. But I think I've got enough cavalry to wipe up the remnants of the enemy here. They're not appearing to be getting any more reinforcements, this must be the last few. So I'm hoping with this victory we'll be able to keep Gilbeji and Tyr secure for now. I'm tempted to try curing Castle even though it's a siege tower and just get it done. But uh, yeah, that was a good victory. We managed to escape, that's fine with me. Well, I probably should start taking them prisoner, but... So we'll get Jelbeji, then Curing Castle is the one we've been after. We could take Telrog, Ismeria, and then we just sort of move around, take Wurcheg and Rivercheg if we can. With any luck. And then after that, I guess I'll turn back on the Rodox. Anyway, that's it for now. Thank you for watching, join me next time.